Welcome to Bubble Man's World. Welcome to Puff Wednesday. I think this is a Puff Wednesday. And welcome Thomas, my new um, colleague and business partner dash colleague uh, at Grandmaster LEDs. Uh, if you guys saw the recent video on Grandmaster LEDs, uh, Grandmaster Level YouTube channel, uh, as well as BC Bubble Man's Bubble Man's World channel, we did a big video announcing that I'm now working with Grandmaster LEDs. I've actually been working with Thomas for some months now, kind of in the back end of things. This is now us putting the tarantula board lights that he has brought to with him into these two 5x5 tents. We've got our pumps, we've got our reservoir off camera, and we've got our tent expert, Johnny B. Uh, if you haven't been here before, you've seen Johnny B and I build and put tents together. So we're going to blast these out, I guess, here in the next uh, half an hour to 45 minutes. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited to mount those lights. Um, I'm really excited for the lights. Yeah. I'm and really Johnny B yeah. brought his light meter. Of course. Yeah. And we get to talk about light recipes. We can test them. See, out. see, this is what's really cool, is really seeing new technologies come to market and, and seeing what this is. This is going to be good. Okay, we got to do this. Just wait. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah. All right, here we go. Put it right on top of that box. From my understanding, this goes in. That's last. Yeah, exactly. Same with this. That's probably the inside. So corner the joint. Or the joints. Power pieces. Okay, so that's the length. I said these must go in height. Johnny, stop it. You said you weren't doing anything. I haven't done this before, as you can You're see. You're doing everything, fun. John. What the heck? I know you have some dabs. Um, Give me a foot. Um, like I said, um, what's nice about doing tents and doing this for so long, it's really quite easy. We'll start with the base, guys, and really just quick and simple. Everything is got to lock in. Always have them to the inside, so that way they don't get kicked or pushed on the inside. So right. always make sure they go on the inside when you put them on your bottom board. Like I said, I guess I've done this before. I think so, we've done it a few times. Is there one other tall one? Is this it right here? This, that's the one? Now looking here, so I'm seeing some bottoms here. So this here's got a bottom and bottom. So it doesn't look right to me. Well, because it's not. Two of them are ones and two of them are twos. <laughs> okay, yeah, are like, the ones and the twos exactly the same? Yeah, they, think, yeah. Oh no. Are they? Yeah. yeah, they're the same one. Yeah. All right. Here's, We're looking at here is on the bottom. These have, have these these should have to be the ones bottom. in between, no? Those ones are going up, too, stacked too high. Oh, okay. That's yeah. What, that's what yeah. got me. But look, on the bottom here, John, we need to have the two opposing are ones and the two opposing are twos. I don't know why they have it that way. So they got ones and twos. Let's just make it. got a that. one? You got a one there, I got a one here. I got a two here. Okay, well, that's a two. And then this one, which I'm almost Is that certain. A one or a two? I'm almost certain it's a one. Yeah, it's a one. So I'll just replace it with this two. Maybe it means nothing. But you know what? Let's just try to follow the simple rule. We follow can, the rules? We can do that. that goes up the other way. See on the bottom? Okay, gotcha. I gotcha. Right? Yeah. So there's no... Three and a three and a three. And a four. Or, sorry, here's a four. Oh yeah, I need fours. Four first. Four first. This must be funny to watch. It's like, yeah, we haven't built a tent in a while, but been a little bit. But hey, there's a one. I guess we're gonna need to do our ones again. Yeah. So which ones are our ones? These ones, right? So a one will go here as well. You wanna get another spot? Okay, this will all come together, guys. This is the magic right here. Watch the confusion. There you go. Oh yeah, Watch. The, oh yeah, right off the bat, this doesn't line up. These, these, this isn't right. Okay. Uh, I'll put it. All right, I this on one, one, I think, let me just hold that for a second, goes like this. Oh, 
Told you it's confusing coming on this last part. Oh, you didn't even get to see it. Damn. Damn. I don't think that is. That's true. No. They saw it. They're doing it. They're watching yeah. a little bit of the madness that's going on in my dirty ass garage. There we go. Make sure you flip that back. The screen. Cheers, Johnny B. So now these are. These go up top. Our top. So we've got two and one big one right across the middle. Here comes the fun part. Yeah, totally. The funnest part is actually putting the tent over this. So that's the one that goes right across. I think it's the bottom right here. That's the bottom? Okay, so that's what we need to slide over. Yes, we're okay. getting there. We're getting there. So check it out. That one's a T, and they want the T, just one half of the T to go in like this. So we gotta go underneath the donk. Yes, right underneath it. You're right. Pull it back up outside, Josh. Yeah, yeah, and it's like the whole thing. Lift that hard. I just realized we need a tray for you. It's supposed to be. Um, is that the tea? You go up, go up, go up. Do you see where we can get him out of that? Where'd he go? Yes, open the window. You I, trying to get him I don't know. Yeah, yeah, get him in there, right? The window is there. Is there a window in there? Yeah. These are weird. <laughs> You're weird? No. It's a black box. I'm just looking. Like, no, this I side. Like, Over here. There we go. Over here? <laughs> oh, there you are. There I am. Right there. I was in here. I know. There you go. I was in here. Okay, so. Should we bust another tent, gentlemen? Bust another tent. Let's bust another tent. Go. Where are the scissors at? I appreciate that. Oh, okay. oh yeah. The is this already comes with a bottom plate. The only thing, reason why I, I mentioned the other thing is it's nice to have a hard tray that you can screw in a hose that then leads to a... Um, uh, a sump pump. Yeah. So what is this? Just like you spin it. It's oh. a two. So then I'll put one line to this down. We already have one end. You don't. You only need to put that on one end, and it has to be on the right one, or it won't line up. But this one can go right there. That's the beauty of knowing whether you did it right or not. I think it's easier than so you don't so you don't have to risk it. Well, this, it. this is this is the learning lesson number two. Like now now the best part of both is if we open right? this tent up properly, they make this so you can open up and you don't have to do this shit. We just did. Let's make sure we do it. That's kind of what I was hoping. Oh, so that we, we could we just, just like totally butchered it last time. Yeah, the well, total butcher. I was like, stop. We couldn't have got my okay. tent any here. That's for so sure. So let's take a look. Here. This is gonna be this is the bottom plate. Remember that. Let's take a look at the bottom. Because it's a T. Remember the bottom's actually in the middle. So if you look at this. the, yeah, the, the bottom is and in the middle. the bottom is right, let's go that way. So, I'm going to test it up. It's going to come right out of here. Where are we going? Well, the bottom's going to go up, it's going to wrap around the right side. Okay. And we're going to put the T. Yeah, we need to fix this. This is the T, so you've got to open this up. Okay, there's the ball. That's yes, the ball. That's the ball. There, there we go. There we go. Hey, hey boys. We're getting this, boys. I feel like we're doing it. I feel like we're really doing it. Let's go ahead. So if you can have fun while, you know, building some Lego tents.
tent with your buddies. Is it fun? Yeah, is it fun? I'm going to slow down, wait. Let's keep it simple. I'll be honest. What's nice I'm... about this is how this one comes off. That one on the floor. Thomas, are you going to turn this side here? Oh, this corner up here. This corner here. Line up. Take that top over. I've got that one in tight. Oh, would you look at that? And now we just walk this around. Oh, walk yeah, this around. we walk this around. Yeah, I do this part. Check this out, guys. Check your partner. Come on out here, take your bow, guys. Everybody, Mark, Thomas, Mark, come on out here. Just a second, I'm gonna finish the zipper. Here. Look out! Look come out! On, guys. Let's Look get out! Oh, okay, we're we're finish them up. Done. Done. Push them out. Okay, ready? Let's take a bow. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! That was fun. My was? ten. That one worked out well. See? Johnny B. That's how it's done. Good yeah. job, guys. Awesome, brother. Take <laughs> here. This is better. We're just having yeah. fun. We're That's just having fun. That's the best fun. Of a ten. That was fun. Let's get that light out, okay, boys. Now we'll to me, yeah, it's okay. all about this light. No offense to the tents and the pumps and the thises and the thats and the reservoir, but this light. Careful too, it might be. Oh, it's upside down. Surprised it made it here. Okay, we're gonna flip this tent. What's that? We're gonna completely flip the tent. What do you mean? <laughs> oh, it's totally upside down. I was just gonna say. Well, what does it matter if we flip it upside down? No, do you know what? There's a hole on. There's a vent on the bottom. I'm like, they put Should them on the ground. Yeah, just flip it. Let's flip oh. it. Let's flip 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 it. Let's
And you know, we grow canvas, cucumbers, peppers, and tomatoes. That's what this light's able to do. It can grow all different types of products. It, it can lead R&D if you're trying to so test what spectrums things. are the absolute best to do. Um, this, it, there's universities that are going to be using this across the world to be testing stuff out. So, Dude, and, can we talk a little bit about the efficiency of the light and how it plays into rebates in North America? Sure. Well, so for efficiency... Well, you can, it doesn't have to be the most efficient to qualify for a rebate, um, but it's got to be over 2.1 micromoles per joule. But why this is so important um, is the efficiency, the efficacy of this light. So you're getting the most amount of light per watt. So say, for example, I can, we could do, put in any company spectrum, except for this light's going to put out more light per watt. Now, when we were designing this light, we've changed this design three different times, actually. And like this thing took over a year to actually develop with us constantly changing it or running into different obstacles. We actually started with four different driver boxes because it's a four channel light. And we just realized it was, it was creating too many connections for us. And there were just so many different things that we changed. And it was, uh, we start, we actually, oh, sorry. No, no, you have to, I was just gonna, you keep going as you're talking as I'm looking at this. Cause of course I'm excited, right? I want to get this thing turned on. Dude, how about this ballast? See, that's what we're looking at. That's our driver ballast. box, and we designed it like this, so if there's ever an issue, <laughs> we can just swap that out. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. So that's what you're talking about, the drivers that are in there. Yeah, it's got, any, four, it's got four, four different drivers. It's got four different drivers. We use Infantronics, which is the world's best drivers, and um, we just don't cut any corners, and it's the best of the best. Well, that's what um, we and this is here. like a... If, now, if you have the infrastructure to be able to run these, because it does... Can, it's possible to go up to 1500 watts even though it's designed to run at 700 watts so it does you do need a bigger infrastructure to run these but the diversity and the competitive edge that you have is just it's endless Are what you can do with the it. power that needs 240 if you're gonna run well, it we, numbers or so we have right. one option of being able to go uh, a driver set that does 120 to 277 volt okay that auto converts and then we also have 277 to 480 volt oh perfect so you got both consumptions yeah you, you definitely well you, you can we can do any plug we any can make plug. it compatible with any country didn't someone That's ask us for 347 recently yes yeah, talk about problems. that well do you know what it's <laughs> what actually, did that mean well, so 90% of actually large facilities are on high voltage, right. and, and they're using the 347. I don't personally like messing with it myself if I could avoid it, because if we get high well, voltage, power. if you get a shock, you can, it, it's high power. It's high power, and it's it can really power. hurt. But what it's is efficient. It's, it's, it's more direct power. and it's, you, it's more efficient, but you also are freeing up more amperage, and that's the big thing about high voltage. So if I'm going from 120, a regular plug, to 240, I'm freeing up double the amperage in my panel. So what you... And when we get into amperage, we talk about that. So when we used to run old HPS bulbs and stuff like that, so many amps are using for startups. So we have to turn different lights on because we blow fuse boxes all the time. Oh, it's a... That's what we used to have, right? Well, do you know, so stuff has evolved. Like, this, like just what the like, amperage for this starting up, what is the just, amperage? Oh, um, I'm just trying... It's going to be roughly on... Sorry, on, I'm just trying to think on one... It's going to be about 6.8 amps if it was running at full power, but you, you never would run it. Never would. That's running at 240. It's going to roughly run about 3.5 amps if you're running at, sorry, at 240. Can you daisy chain these up and control them with one, like, single controller? Or? You can, you, well, you, can, for, you definitely can daisy chain them. They have an RJ45 port so that they connect. And they also are, um, we've actually just developed a new cord so that you can actually daisy chain the lights together. So it's uh, as you say, here's one option right here we got so basic yeah th these are rj45 so they just go so what's kind of cool is about with any of our existing lights they have an rj14 port and when we were designing our controller we wanted anybody going to hook up to a troll master it, it is compatible with a troll master yeah, if you want right. but it's also we designed it so that our controller so it can be used with any existing lights that we've ever sold Nice. And anybody else, like we basically made it so it can be yeah, kind of compatible with any other ones. Yeah, we have. Dude, what is your deal trying to make shit compatible? That's not how the world works. <laughs> Sorry, man. everything's We're supposed to be to... incompatible, so it drives no, you. It's kind of like an apple. You can only buy apple. At least you can have things that work with one another. Dude, listen, that's that's a nice vibe right off the bat because it you sort of shows start. like, look, we're not, you know, let's just create compatibility. Turn this thing on. Let's, let's I'm look, listen. I'm excited. We're gonna need to figure out what we need to get to hang that light because I'm sure there's something we need. Things. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna turn it off for a second, but okay, we'll be perfect. right back. Awesome. All right. Just put it in some ratchets here, real quick. This all comes with the light. Wanna 
Let's get the other one set up for the other side. And then it's just a matter of putting the other one on the other side. That's easy. That makes like a single person. I can't wait to see this thing light up, dude. It's going to be bright. <laughs> it's going to be bright. I got to get some cannabis plants in here. Well, hopefully next week we can get that going. Oh, trust me, dude. I won't be waiting much longer. I got some seeds for it. I won't have, yeah? Well, I think Life Cycle Botanics is going to have some cuts ready for us. Oh, nice. Ooh. Life Cycle Botanics. Maybe get some Doug Bubba in really here for the guys. first run. We went over to the facility, guys, and checked out that place. It was awesome. What they're doing at Lifestyle Botanicals, it was it was really sweet. So I, I, that was a really cool Do you want to come over here, Johnny, and you can line this one up? This. You can Mike put this need... one in? Okay, here, John. Oh, no, no, no. So this is going to go right there. Go, I normally do this on myself. It's so much easier doing it with two people, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, I'm Sorry. enjoying this. Although I definitely like his style. I, I can like easily do that by myself. Together. That was awesome. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, that was awesome. Absolutely. Yeah. Now you just bring it up. Oh, wait, we're going to have to get the driver in first. Well, we're going to go right to there. Oh, yeah, where are you going to put the driver? Up top? Right on there. You know what? Oh, yeah, I think, right on top. I think we yeah. can get it higher without the driver. Yeah. So, I think so I'll just too. send you an extension. Sure. Right, here we go. Well, well, wait, we're we're going to just turn it on, though. We'll just get it like, we'll mount yeah. it like this just to get it higher. Oh, fired my God, you could put the driver on the roof of the tent. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Look at that. Yeah. Some decent coverage. That's the kind of craziest looking tent LED light I've ever seen, actually. Well, we actually Damn. have a light that's designed for a tent called the Tarantula Tent Ultimate that's 56 by 56 inches that goes into the very far corners that has a special diode configuration to have the most uniform ID, cool. or the best uniformity that the world's ever seen. Nice. But this is more for Marcus to kind of play with spectrum tuning. Well, that's what I'm looking forward to. And looking to, to manipulate. See what I can find in the world of resin. Yeah, you want to manipulate it to have it ooze more resin. Yeah, absolutely. And without question, this is going to be the best option. Sick. Well, uh, you know what? What I'm doing actually even at my own place right now is I swept out like four different lights talking about exactly what you're doing. Right, by seeing those light spectrums and how we're doing this, exactly what the future is being, because you can create your own spectrum and take a look at how it's going to produce resin. I love it. Absolutely. I'm, I'm excited. You know, well, let's get an extension cord and plug this in just to see. Perfect. Well, it's going to take a second, so you might as well just stop Push it. Push-ups. Johnny B's alarm just went off. Oh, shit. I, 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 Sorry, man. You don't have to, but no, we do. I'm, I'm in, man. All right, let's get, to, let's get going, boys. Johnny B, face the camera over there. I was going to get Johnny on the military push-ups. It's, it's what happens. It's, 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 it's push-up time. Oh. Okay. Get in here. Well, I'm going this way. Are you? Oh, there okay. you go. Okay. All right, here we go. Ready? Here we go. 20? Yeah. Keep going. See, it's called a pattern interrupt, guys. That's what's great. He's like, yeah, push ups. I'm like, using good shit. <laughs> on my shoulder, I can feel. You know what? You know what's awesome? You know, you go, I do 10, 20, 30, 40. I'm going to try to keep up with Mark here. I can just He's feel totally my shit. You're not doing real push ups and your nose touches the ground. I haven't seen that nose touch the ground. I still did 20. Yes. I don't think I did. Yes. Oh, of course it's hard to get your nose to touch the ground when you got a hat oh, on. Not a, it is a little hard. You know so what? I got a problem Plus, with my shoulder that I just diagnosed. You know, I didn't know. So. Now oh, we're doing push-ups. I, I, like, I didn't know I had an issue with my shoulder. I can feel that. Dude. That's funny. That's done. Do you need like you, you three need, in each one? Or? No, no. Just one's fine. Just one in the middle? Yep, one's fine. You get that one, one in the middle? Yep. You sure? You need one? Oh, no, I'm good. Are you good? Here you go. Right, no, I just got to do that. Just put it in this side. Okay, okay. Oh, thanks, man. Oh, Woo! Well, here's, here's <laughs> the blue part. It's been a move, bro. <laughs> I'm fucking... Woo! <laughs> I, I almost fell right back. Like, there's nothing I can do. Well, at, at least the tent close. caught you. Fuck. Fuck. There's nowhere to go. Okay. Okay. Now, wait, where's the plug now? Where's the what? Plug it in. There's the plug down there. Oh, the, the plug's right plug. here. Where's the plug? I'm gonna plug that in. And then we're gonna have to get an extension cord. We'll have to locate it. Oh, interesting. Very, very interesting. Getting this done. Oh yeah, let's get the, should we hang it with the other cords first, you know what I mean, and then we'll... Here's the manual for the Borg, and it goes through and shows there's pages and pages and pages of light frequency spectrums. You can see this is the double blue he was talking about. 
You talk about the far red, 730 nanometer. It's a whole shit ton of presets. Whole shit ton of presets? Interesting. I'm like, I've never been more stoked to light up a light. I, I can say that. All right, we got this light and driver mounted. It was pretty easy. Mostly all done on camera. Just need four people to lift it up. That's it. All we needed was four people to. Four people. That's it. Or three disabled I'm people. Where's the third, fourth person? I missed that. Oh. You're two people, Johnny. There you go. Okay. So then we're going to need another plug for the. There we go. Ah. Oh, what do you got there? So we can control them all. We can, so we can first start by controlling the. No, so that's the 9000K channel. Whew. It's crazy, insanely blue. Damn. Bluer than it's any light has ever been able blue, to go. Blue, blue. In a commercial fixture. Yeah. And okay, then, so here is the warm white channel. This and is it, warm white? It looks very similar to what HPS is. Yeah, it does. Except for HPS also has a um, 730 nanometer in it. So now this is our 660 nanometer. This is really hard on the eyes. Oh man. Without glasses, it's... I know. It's, it's really blinding. Oh my god, it is terrible. And then, Johnny B's got his light meter out, and he's doing some measurements. All right. Oh, it's 419. I mean, one minute warning. You know I'm all about the one. So that's an all red spectrum, so there you guys go there. You can take a look what's going on here and what he's talking about. And, and I'll add the up far red to that, so actually. So the far red now? So we Well, with, with that. With yeah, I'm going to redo it again. There's oh. the far red, so you can see you added the 730. So you dump that in there, so you can, I, I, yeah, we can have fun here, guys. Now let's add the warm white to it. Okay, now we're going to do the Or, sorry, half. this is the, it feels like warm white because that there was so red, even though so it, says, it says command has been finished, yeah. So now you can see the, the coming up. Does it really show up on my I'm camera? I'm surprised that more doesn't come up there. Or is oh, that, there is that what we're, what's on right now? Yeah, Just 100%. What's on right now. Yeah, I'll do it one more time. Is it, if you hold it at different angles, will it change? No. No, okay. that's what you have there right now. Okay. And then let's. Uh, it's weird. It just doesn't want to show up on the camera. It's just black. Now let's see what happens if you put it all on. Because uh, it's 420. Oh, look Whoa. at all the green. Jesus. Wow. I just wish that I could see it better. It's so weird. Now, yeah, I have to zoom in so far to see the light meter. There we go. It's got that double blue, far red, big green. Well, yeah, we could have a lot of fun with this, guys. I think better if I look at this one. Mm-hmm. So really manipulating in all different light spectrum, and here's what we're really seeing here, guys. And so now you can see this. Go down this light. Where do you go out there on low? Check this out. So you just all red. So yeah, this is just the far red. Yeah, just far red. That's pretty cool to see. And doing that on the fly, now give me some all blue. 731 nanometers. Okay, so now I'm gonna go check out over here. We'll come over here. See, yeah, see the spike of blue? Oh, I see it. All right, so that's gonna be good for tending on the spacing and what we're looking at. We can talk. We can, there's a lot so we can talk about all kinds of things. I mean, if we would have had light like this back in like when we were trying to use it, all these and stuff. For, we were growing in two foot, three foot area, so you had to get certain. You can use light to manipulate plants. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's so beautiful. Dude, I'm just so excited. It, I, I'd be so excited. I would. Yeah, this is like just this, the, how much things have evolved. This, that's, can you just imagine for like the first twenty years of my growing? If you have an issue, you walk, you open the door, and you're hit with a heat wave because yeah. you didn't know you had a I failure. Know. Look I at know. that. Look at that. <laughs> that's that's all blue with tiny bit of red. So understanding, you can have so much fun and look at plant manipulation. And once you start understanding what the different you know spectrums have to offer, what the that's all the, red that, and that's the blue, the whole new learning then process. then it's, it's an endless education. amount. It, it's, it's, it's we literally have particular. To, to just test and of R and D and, and, and are you are you testing for how well it grows the, the cannabis? Are you are you testing everything. how well it grows everything. resin? Everything. Or are you yeah? How and about, anything. How about your fruits right. and vegetables? Are you testing to keep your plant shorter? shorter? Are you trying to stretch? Make your plant well, stretch? Well, your plant shorter. It's it's, it's pretty, pretty much a red. You can actually stretch it with yeah. far red, so you can elongate stem, create leaf expansion. We're and this is all. It's pretty exciting. It's exciting because when I was in, like in Mexico, I went to I went to uh, when I was in I, I took my light meter all over the world, so I'm seeing all different cool spectrums. 
yeah, and understanding. Yeah. So this is and then be a lot of fun. This is yeah. This is a lot of fun, dude. It's awesome. Borg. Dude, work. Tarantula. Yeah, I, I appreciate it. I really appreciate what, what's going on here and the, just the technology and what's happening. Well, let's get and that second animation. one hung, man. Yeah, I'm excited. Good. This looks so good. I can't, I can't believe how good it looks, man. Well, we should ha hopefully have this thing up and running within a week or so. Oh, I'm going to be absolutely yeah, on right it. Now. We're going to be pushing. All right, final tent lit up. Oh, man. I know, it's so bright. You have the we shades have on your head, dude. Oh, I didn't know. <laughs> I don't know where they were. Oh. I, on the other hand, see. No, where's yours? You had yours on. Yours are uh, mine are yours. No, there's two extra pairs. Yeah, no, there's two pairs. Yeah. He's wearing one, and you're wearing one. No, there's one. a third pair. No, there's two pairs. There's one only two. One came with each light. Oh, there was. Oh, no, three. I brought a pair too, though. Yeah, you oh. A pair. Yes, I mean, I just had a pair on. You took yours off. These ones. All right, so this is you know just Jerry rigged for now. Yeah, we're gonna get this. We're gonna get this light set up properly eventually. All the extension cords, all of this stuff will be kind of out of the way. But this is just the beginning of getting a couple of five by five. I don't even have enough extension cords, so that's why this one's dark while this one's light. But we lit them both up. Everything's working. The drivers are working on both of them. Sitting here, you can mask in the sun. <laughs> gonna get some cannabis plants in I here. Feel the heat. In the very near future. What do you mean? You can envision it, plants growing this. We put a scrogging system in here. I do like, you should put a scrog system in here for them. Make it really nice, get single top coals with this, make it really nice and scrog it You know what, I think I'm just gonna play around. I'm just gonna play around. Gonna have a good time. These tents are certainly not. Out there. I'm standing here. They, are, they have these clips that you can they clip on for hooking up to tents. Yeah, I just, the first time I ever saw them recently, they're kind of sick, nice. so they just have everything grow right through. Beautiful. He's going to have it running with a grow link sensor, so like everything is completely automatic and we're going to be having them as a guest to talk about it and it's mind blowing. Like I, do, I can't represent what it can really do. Yeah. It's just so cool. Wicked. It's like they've got, they've got incorporated AI into their system oh, dude, and thought of every last possible language. thing that it could do. So Beautiful. Well, listen guys, we're going to write, say, say sayonara here. Peace to Johnny B who brought his light meter. Thank you so much. Dude, it's cool to see that. Thomas from Grandmaster LEDs, you're gone. I have to like, there you are. Boom. Thanks for coming out, buddy, and helping put this all together. My pleasure. And I'm, well, I'm Bubble Man. And, uh. Stay tuned to Bubble Man's World because we're going to be showing the weekly progress with these lights, the different frequencies that we're going to use, right down to the resin coming out of the bubble bags and the dry sift screens. And I uh, hope to see you soon. Peace out, everybody. Peace out. Peace. Keep pushing.